Hello, Cornerstone Church family, friends, and guests. I'm Sister Jacqueline Hughes, and here are some announcements that will keep us connected and informed on how we will continue praising our Lord during this worldwide pandemic known as the Coronavirus 19 Disease of 2020. On Sunday, July 12th, the Career and Scholarship Committee will recognize our 2020 graduates during morning worship. If you want your graduate recognized, please fill out the Graduate Recognition Ceremony Questionnaire and turn it into the committee by Thursday, July 9th. Copies of the form are available at the front desk or a copy can be emailed to you. To request a copy, email cs.stonembc at gmail.com. The government has finally deemed churches and houses of worship to be essential. We can now have up to 100 congregants in the sanctuary while adhering to recommended guidelines. If you're entering the church facilities, please wear a face mask. Hand sanitizers are located throughout the building and in the restroom dispensers. Feel free to use them. We practice social distancing. So please notice the marked areas where you may sit in the sanctuary. You may sit on the alternating pews six feet apart. However, families may sit together. Our church ushers are here to assist in physical distancing. Our custodial staff and others are doing what we can to bleach the water fountains, door handles and door bars, light switches, restroom hardware, all surfaces and tables, handrails, pews and chairs. We're even steam cleaning the fixtures, hardware, and certain areas of the sanctuary. Even the praise singers are practicing physical distancing and wearing gloves. As we observe the Lord's Supper, we now use hermetically sealed, individualized cups that contain both the bread and the juice. We want to worship our Lord and assemble together in spirit and truth, but responsibly and in compliance with the official recommended guidelines. We welcome your help suggestions, and cooperation. Although the church office is closed, a skeleton crew is on hand to assist you. You may call 510-530-9166 and we will make arrangements to accommodate your needs. Join us this Tuesday at 6 a.m. for the Cornerstone Mount Zion Prayer Call Hour. It will be worth your while. Now we have an array of churches who call in from as far away as Los Angeles and Indiana, Louisiana, and even New Jersey. The call-in number is 720-820-1437. Again, 720-820-1437. If you have difficulty connecting, simply hang up and redial until you get through. Then, at 6 p.m., the young adults will have a special prayer call on Zoom. For more information on how to join, please contact the church office or Deacon Chris Lucas. This Teaching Tuesday, we will be studying Chapter 26 entitled, The Disciples' Personal Character, from our book, Christian Discipleship. This Wednesday at 7 p.m., we will have prayer meeting and Bible study. So get ready for some exciting lessons to come. If you're wondering how to pay the Lord's tithe, give an offering or give to the pastor's support, or any other Cornerstone ministry, then here are some possible ways to do it. You can use the good old fashioned US Postal Service and simply mail your check or money order to the church. You can stop by the church and deposit your gifts in our secure mail slot at any time. You can leave your gifts with our church staff between 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. Monday through Friday. You can give via the Zelle app using the email address cstonecan dot finance at gmail.com or you can call us at the church office and we'll come by and pick it up thank you for faithfully supporting the cornerstone nbc your gifts enable us to keep doing the kingdom building work for our lord during this unprecedented time please pray for us and remain patient with us as our media ministry help us adjust to this new world of virtual worship our media ministry is striving to improve your worship, classroom, and viewing experience over the internet as we all learn the most effective ways to navigate and use this medium to minister to you and for His glory. During this time of testing and trusting, please remain prayerful for our pastor, spiritual leaders, and teachers while praying for one another. Remember our seasoned saints and sick and shut-ins. Also, 
let us pray for our local, state, and national leaders. Discipleship leaders, make every effort to contact those in your disciple team and pray with them. Also, while talking with them, please collect their email addresses so we can keep them spiritually connected. Remember to sanitize and disinfect. You may go to our Facebook, Instagram, or YouTube platforms to receive tips on preventing and treating COVID-19. You may also view the most recent updates regarding COVID-19 with Sister Liz Water. For other information, you may call the church office or simply consult the church's website, Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube platforms. Let this scripture encourage you. Now the Lord is the Spirit, and where the Spirit of our Lord is, there is freedom. 2 Corinthians 3.17 I'm Sister Jacqueline Hughes, and Dr. Lester L. Cannon Sr. is our pastor. We love you, Pastor, and we are praying for you daily. Have a great week.